it's here. So you're going to hear the pitter-patter of little feet and children playing in the background, but I couldn't wait to open it and show you how pretty this is. Let's see if I can get all the angles and the shimmering. This is the crinite magenta. I'm um, pink is my color. I'm a 16 year survivor, breast cancer survivor. And so this will be my second pink pen. And the first one was was pretty, but this one this one really is beautiful. Thank you so much Carol and Sean for the beautiful work that you do. You it's <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> These kids are really having fun back there. It's just, it's really satisfying having something that you know is a one of a kind, beautiful craftsmanship. And this, I asked, um, and it's so hard to make decisions, but when you know that it's something so special, you want it, or at least I wanted it to be just the way, I don't know, just the way I wanted it. So um took me a while to decide, but um, I asked for a shallower divot. So you can see that it has the divot, but it's not as deep. And then on the ends, um, they're thick. I wanted, I, I feel, I do have fibromyalgia. So I wanted the um, a thicker, I, I find that it's more comfortable for me to work with a little bit thicker um, pen um, with the one that's already been made for me. Um, the thicker end I seem to gravitate towards. Um, so this end, as you can see, is a little thicker than this end. And I wanted it that way so that I could um, flip back and forth. And so... Um, I can switch back and forth and use um, one end over the other if I feel like um, I need to change the end that I'm using. Um, both um, single tip because I um, always use the checkerboard method. So um, I, ha I find that I get, um, I use a lot of um, paintings that are real confetti paintings, so the checkerboard method works really well for me to get good straight um, square patterns going well, straight um, drills. So there she is. The This is um, the Crinite Magenta. Um, I guess you could say four bump um, shallow divot with um, the um, a thick one end a little thicker than the other end.